What's up, everybody? I'm Derek Gamer. Welcome back to the channel. We are continuing on with Final Fantasy 15. Now, the last area we were in was a freaking pain to get out of, but now, now we're on a new path to a new journey. So let's continue on and see what happens. I'm pretty sure our girl over here with the damn horn is going to leave us. Made it out in one piece. Or maybe turn her back on us, though. Let's see what happens. And I read online that the game is split into two parts. So the first half of the game is really like open world based, so you can like explore and do a bunch of things. I think after chapter eight, nine, I believe chapter nine is where the game kind of locks up and kind of turns more story based. So we're qu we're quickly approaching that. So I want to make sure we're taking advantage of the cycles as well. So let's see what happens Congrats. here. Congrats, that concludes your training. You've still got a hard path ahead, but don't let anyone tell you how to walk it. <laughs> Thanks. You may have been hired under false pretenses, but your assistance was invaluable all the same. Yeah? <laughs> Tell me something I don't know. You can spare the pleasantries. Take care walking your path, Aranea. Aranea. Oh, right. Thanks. I, I will. And I'll train you some more if our paths cross again. Oh, thanks. Oh, and before I forget, His Excellency instructed me to give you boys a ride back. If you need a lift, feel free to hop on. Well, glad that's over with. <laughs> Noct, I've just received word from Cindy. And? We're to return to Lestalum. Her friend works as an engineer at the power plant. She'll take care of the mithril. Uh-huh. And that'll take care of our boat problem. Once you're rested and ready, I suggest we hasten back to Lestalum. Make sure you're prepared. Okay, so I got to talk to her. Shame to, make to say goodbye happen. to such a nice fishing spot. Want to see what's biting before we bolt? What is he? It's a shop? Oh, cool. I need some stuff too. Like running out of potion and everything. Ah. So I stopped up with some gear. This guy sells weapons. I need to start upgrading my weapons for my other guys too so they can stand out. Help us fight a little harder. Ice band. Hmm. All right. So after all that, we finally got some new gear for our boys now. So everybody should be lasting longer in battle except Pronto. Pronto has like an abnormally low health, which I think is ridiculous. But all right, so we're gonna get him some more gear and uh, maybe uh, level him up a little bit. But before I leave, let me get this trust real quick. But I have a newfound respect for Pronto because I actually watched a Brotherhood anime that came out before the game, so it kind of gives you a little background story on the characters. If you haven't watched it, highly recommend you checking it out because it fills in the gap as far as their relationship, how they came to know each other, and kind of like how they, why they are the way they are. And I have a lot more respect for Pronto because he was a fat boy and he lost weight in order to be friends with Noctis. So it's a good episode if you didn't see. It's only like 10 minutes long, I believe. So let's talk to this chick and um, keep it moving, shall we? You're headed to Lestalem, right? Uh, I'll take you there, but no further. Got it. So, ready to ship out? Uh, yep. Of course, like always, you're not going to be able to return for some time. Let's go. <laughs> let's fly. Hold on tight, boys. Uh, look at that! A red ship. Oh, that's cool. She's fancy. Got a little fancy red ship. When are we going to get our ship? Well, don't spoil it if you know. <laughs> Rise and shine, Prince Charming. We're here. Where are we? Sounds like a spot of troubles popped up at the power plant. Of course. Mm, wish I could help, but I'm powerless to do anything I'm not ordered to. I'll leave the keeping of the peace to you. Of course. We got this. Good luck, boys. Thank you. Several hours later. Oh, that's cool. We didn't have to do anything. It's coming. They do doing everything for us. Hmm. Loving that outfit, Noct. <laughs> Why don't you wear one? Oh, that's the only one. And if anyone stands a fighting chance in there, it's you. Forget <laughs> about fashion and go. That's what we have to do here. Cut out of the demon stabilized generators. Cool. <laughs> Testing. Do you read me? Indeed. Just wanted to thank you for offering to clear out those demons. That'll give me time to treat this mithril for you. Yeah, no worries. There's a hunter who went in right ahead of you. I imagine there are too many for one to handle. Maybe it was Gladius? But two of you should be fine. Or a core? And a little heads up. We're getting some unstable readings from the generators inside. 
too much power and the whole place could blow. So be quick. All right, got it. Will do. So, you my backup? I thought we were partners. <laughs> anyway, place is crawling with demons. Wait a second. That's glad he is. familiar. Save the talk. We got hunting to do. Now, yeah. if we're done with the introductions, follow me. This is my boy. Okay, why did all of a sudden get dark in here? I like the windows brighter. All right, bro, what else? Let me pick this up real quick. Ooh, silver bangle. I got you new weapons, too. And this is how you treat me, bro? Oh, shit. There they are. You ready to rumble? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah that's him. <laughs> It'd be any more obvious. Okay, I was say, wait a minute, this thing said it was level four. I was like, why am I not taking barely any damage off of it? Some pretty fancy things we got there. Reminds me of a certain king I know. Yeah. Not too shabby yourself. You make a good spine brother. Oh, what? I didn't get that. Take a little longer than that. Oh, that's why. Oh, like, damn, bro, you doing any damage to damn thing. There we go. Let's get back into action. Now we got our right equipment on. Should be good to go. All right, cool. That's it. What's one over here? Hey, buddy. Ooh. Oh shit. Looks like it's gonna be a battle royale until all these are taken out care of. There we go. Next. Oh shit, I'm tired. Is there a rest point up here? No, we don't have one. Uh, oh shit. I shouldn't have done that. I'm tired again. Come on, come on, man. Come on, man. Get back into action. We got four minutes to take all these guys. How many, I wonder how many waves we're gonna have. Ooh, next. Shit. I'm gonna need a high potion now. I like organize my stuff so I whatever I want to access is quicker to access. I don't like using these weapons. They don't hit as hard, but they hit a little bit really fast. Damn, why is this one so strong? There it is. Oh, we did it. I think so. Nice job. It didn't disappoint. When have I ever? Uh oh. <laughs> Keep it up. We'll do. Now let's scram. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. And my boy needs to tell us what the hell he was doing in here. Why he abandoned us? Oh shit. Okay, this one over here. Close, 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 but um, I'm kind of digging these outfits. They're, kinda, they're like semi-fresh. <laughs> but that was a pretty e easy mission. All right, is he going to talk to us now? Great work in there. As promised, here's your mithril. Thanks. And uh, thank you for your hard work. Sure. Hey, big guy. So the hunter who went on ahead. The one and only. <laughs> How you been, fellas? <laughs> Not bad. Whoa, someone did a number on you, though. Yeah. You should see the other guy. Anyway, I'm back. God Better damn. Than ever. You guys ass kicked. Knocked? Gladdy? I can't believe it. Hey, thanks for looking after her, Dustin. So, Gladdy, did you apologize to Knocked for storming off like that? Nope. He made it up to me in there. The power plant? Oh, so you got your hands on some mithril. 
In that case, I'll go deliver it to Sid. You'll probably want to freshen up first anyway. Come and meet me in Kayam when you're ready. Okay, sounds good. Alright, so big guy, he got some, a lot of experience to go, and I got some new weapons for you. Let's put that on him. Get them all ready to go. That is... Alright, so let's go talk to Sid. See what he has in store for us, and see what options come available to us. Hopefully we get something that we can help us travel a little quicker. Because the regalia is cool and all, but um, I need something a little more more speed. So many stalls here. All full of foods I've never eaten. The aroma is indeed tantalizing. I'm detecting a rather unique blend of spices. Hey boys, I have a job for rough and ready sorts like you and yours. Ah, uh, okay. If you're not busy, I'd like you to head over to my farm and bring back some produce. Was about to send a request to Hunter HQ. And so we fast traveled because I was tired of driving all over the damn place. So this is the area. This place looks really, really how nice it looks. Goddamn. Good, nice vegetation. Rocks look good. My, my goodness. So we're going to go to our boat now. Because we got all the mithril. We got the supplies we needed in order to activate this damn thing. So let's see what Sid has up his sleeve. And hopefully he can upgrade my weapons from here. I don't have to go back to his main fortress in order to upgrade my gear. So let's see what happens next. All right, Sid, buddy. I'm here. Good. How y'all doing? Amazing. Are you riding? If y'all are having car trouble, Cindy's your girl. What about gear trouble? Let's go around and pick up the special looking for your bounce. Ooh. What are we, oh, that goddamn cat again. I'm not getting any more fish, bro. Oh, dear. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is, looks like this is a spot where we actually lose access to our open world. So this is where we're going to take our break. In the next episode, we're driving all the way through. We're going to finish some couple of side quests, and we're going to continue on with them. So, thank you very much for watching. If you're new to the channel, thanks for joining the Smooth Family. Until next time, dear gamer, signing out.